Hey guys, happy Friday, April 16th. I am here to bring you your daily meditations and I am crooked as all hell. Guys, you know what? Like, I'm sorry. And then I'll look at that after and be like, no, bitch, you should have kept it the other way. Anyway, we're going to jump off. We're going to start this off. I'm a day late with this one. I just did our today reading. I'm going to get this one out first and then our today reading. You'll understand. I'm a day behind, so we're doing two today. So um, today's Saturday, but we're really going to read Friday, April 16th. We're going to start off. No, let's start off with Melanie Beatty first today. We're going to start off with Melanie Beatty, Language of Letting Go. We're going to turn to April 16th. Okay, guys, here we go. April 16th, letting things happen. We do not have to work so hard at gaining our insights. Yes, we're learning that painful and disappointing things happen, often for a reason and a higher purpose. Yes, these things often work out for good, but we don't have to spend so much time and energy figuring out the purpose and plan for each detail of our life. That's hypervigilance. Sometimes the car doesn't start. Sometimes the dishwasher breaks. Sometimes we catch a cold. Sometimes we run out of water, have a bad day. While it helps to achieve acceptance and gratitude for these irritating, irritating annoyances, we don't have to process everything and figure out if it's in the scheme of things. Solve the problem. Get the, get the car repaired. Fix the dishwasher. Nurse yourself through your cold. Wait to take a shower until there's hot water. Nurture yourself through your bad day. Tend to your responsibilities and don't take everything so personally. If we need to recognize a particular insight or awareness, we will be guided in that direction. Certainly, we want to watch for patterns, but often the big insights and the significant proce processing happen naturally. We don't have to question every occurrence to see how it fits into the plan. The plan, the awareness, the insight, the potential for personal growth will reveal itself to us. Perhaps a lesson is to learn to solve our problems without always knowing their significance. Perhaps a lesson is to trust ourselves to live and experience life. Today, I will let things happen without worrying about the significance of each event. I will trust that this will bring out my growth faster than running around with a microscope. I will trust my lessons to reveal themselves in their own time. That was a good one. I mean, I think I, I pretty, I'm, I'm, I'm on top of that game already. I'm, I got so much shit going on. I couldn't sit there. I just wouldn't have the time to sit there and analyze each little thing that goes on. Um, and my memory is so bad. I, I just forget about shit anyway. So it's like, I'll be all, oh, look at the bird. Oh guys, I don't know how to turn this around. Look how freaking cute. Watch, by the time I turn around, it'll be gone. Anyway. All right. I'm distracted. Um, yeah, it's just, it's too much. I'll be a mess one day thinking it's the end of the world and I'll wake up the next day and I don't even remember. I'll be like, oh yeah, oh shit, that sucks. You know what I mean? I'm pretty fly by the seat of my pants kind of girl. I don't really worry. And that's, it's been a downfall. It's, it's not a good thing <laughs> that I do that. But, um. Yeah, man, I couldn't imagine running around analyzing every little aspect of my life. I'd be driven nuts. More nuts than I already am. Guys, we're going to jump over now to Just for Today, Narcotics Anonymous. Take your little book out. Turn to April 16th. Try not to get confused here. Acting as if. Did we read this before? Wait a minute. This sounds awfully familiar. Dun, 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 dun. Am I on the right one? Act, April. Okay. The first time we heard that we should act as if, many of us exclaimed, but that's not honest. I thought we were supposed to be honest about our feelings in Narcotics Anonymous. Perhaps we can reflect on when we first came into the program. We may not have believed in God, but we prayed anyway. Or maybe we weren't sure the program would work for us, but we kept coming to meetings regardless of what we thought. The same applies as we progress in recovery. We may be terrified of crowds, but if we act confidently 
and extend our hand, we'll not only feel better about ourselves, we'll find we're no longer so afraid of large gatherings. <laughs> not these days, huh? Each action we take in this vein brings us closer to becoming the people we were meant to be. Each positive change we make builds our self-esteem. Through acting differently, we will realize that we are beginning to think differently. We are living oursel ourselves into right thinking by acting as if. Just for today, I will take the responsibility to act as if I can accept the situation that I used to run from. That's a thought-provoking one. I would have to really sit and think about that reading and pick it apart in depth. I guess I can do that in certain situations. Um, like where it says, change your thinking to be more positive until it is more positive. I could probably do that. But like something that really bothers me or something that I really um, struggle with, I can never put on a front and like go through with it let me not say never because you know what we can do anything but i just can't see myself doing that for certain for a lot of reasons um number one i always i always have just been this person that's outspoken and tells you how i feel no matter what it is and i don't know if i'd be able to pull off the fake but i don't really know if they're saying be fake i think they're you know saying just put your best foot forward and act like go with the flow and I guess I can do that I'm not sure I'm not sure that one that I'm a little I'm stuck on that one let me know what you guys think down below guys I gotta go to the grocery store I had a great day with you guys reading these readings let me know your thoughts in the comments below please subscribe guys I'm really trying to grow my family over here I'm sick of talking to myself can somebody talk back to me please I got some friends over here all right, guys. Thanks. Today's a good day for a good day, and I'll see you guys here again tomorrow.